Welcome to Property TV. I'm Cole Mooney from Ray White Ashgrove in Paddington. Today we'll talk with Dennis Sherlock about building and pest reports for sellers. Yes, you heard right, sellers. We've got a Butte property, it's a family home, under 10 Ks from the CBD, great value. And I'll give you an update on our last feature property in the avenues of Ashgrove. It's sold for a cracker price. First up, here's Kevin Turner with his market update. Thank you. Well, the Treasurer, Andrew Fraser, has announced recently that there'll be a $10,000 grant made to anyone buying a new built home. And in the same announcement, they said that any first home buyer wouldn't have to pay any stamp duty, provided their purchase is under $600,000. Well, certainly when it comes to the $10,000 boost for new builds, that's great news for the struggling building industry. Let's talk more about the sales tax. It's great to see that it's been abolished for first home buyers. But when it comes to anyone who's not a first home buyer, and that's 85% of the market, they now have to pay double the stamp duty. Or as the Treasurer has said, they've simply moved, removed the 50% subsidy that was in place. That's effective as from the 1st of August. This tax that we're talking about was described by the Treasurer only a few months ago as being a relic and now we find that it's actually been doubled. Thanks, Kevin. My guest today is Dennis Sherlock, a building expert. And Dennis, we're going to talk about building inspections for sellers. Now, what are the benefits of doing a building inspection as a seller? They'll know the actual health of their property. And I use the health as in, so it's a healthy property. They'll know exactly what status it is. And if anything's wrong with it, they're going to get no nasty surprises at the end of the day so they're not going to go oh, oh no this is wrong and lose a lot of money on the job and what about the buyer is it still advised for the buyer to instigate his own report the same pro same property same report can be used by the buyer um, because it's all legally binding and been done by a professional and licensed inspector so it's uh, i don't believe it would be uh, of benefit to them Okay. Food for thought from uh, our building expert, Dennis Sherlock. Thanks for your time. Thank you. All the pluses to get you excited and then some. This four bedroom, two bathroom home is ideal for the growing family wanting more bang for your buck. Spread over three levels are a recently upgraded kitchen, stacks of living room, study, a separate kids playroom and then there's the outside, close proximity to schools, parks, shopping, plus only a five minute flat walk to the train station and your 15 minute commute to the CBD. This home truly offers something for the whole family. As you can see, it's a great family home. Now, a quick update before we go on our last feature property. That was in Myaga Street in the avenues of Ashgrove. It, it sold in one week for a tidy sum of $1.6 million. That's our show for today. If you'd like any details on the segments, just go to my website, www.colemooneyproperty.com. Thanks for tuning in. I look forward to seeing you at one of my open homes. Bye for now.